Today on 21st Century Business, explore state-of-the-art technology, innovative business strategies, insights from cutting-edge corporations around the globe, a visionary look into the answers of tomorrow today. Business leaders, business solutions, 21st Century Business. Welcome to 21st Century Business, I'm Jackie Bales. Companies in the marine industry are struggling to find ways to attract younger consumers and offer lower prices, while simultaneously complying with stricter environmental regulations. Well, according to our guest today, solving these problems may begin with something as simple as the paint you choose for your yacht. Joining me is Fred Daou, General Manager of Yacht Americas for Axo Nobel's Yacht Paint Division. Axo Nobel has two strong brands in the U.S. market, Interlux and Allgrip. Welcome, Fred. Hello, Jackie. Thanks for having me. Fred, tell us more about the challenges the marine industry faces currently. One of the biggest challenges we have as an industry is, is getting new people in the boating um, and getting people out on, on the water. Uh, boating is a great leisure activity. Um, it's accessible to all ages, whether you're going out on a boat alone or you're going out as a couple or you're going out as a family. Spending a day on the water is a great way to spend the day. Um, a second area that we, we have as a challenge as far as an industry goes is the perception and, and, and often misconception uh, that boating is very expensive and it's for the elite only. Mm -hmm. and, and that's actually not the case. There are a, a wide range of, of boats and sizes that are available to people that hit all the different budgets and all the different income brackets. Mm -hmm. um, a third area that, uh, that, that, that we face as a challenge is the environmental regulations. And, and rightfully so, understandably, uh, the regulations are stricter today than they have been in the past and um, it does cause some areas is a confusion for businesses that are operating in the boating uh, industry as well as sometimes some confusion for boat owners. Hmm. So how do Interlux and Allgrip help the industry respond to these issues? Well, some of the things we're doing is, uh, firstly, on, on getting people in the boating, is that we're working very closely with the National Marine Manufacturers Association and the State Marine Associations on their grow boating campaigns to, to get people in the boating, introduce them to boating. Uh, the grow boating campaigns spend a lot of advertising. Um, they, they run these marina days, that they call them, where they actually get people down to marinas and yacht clubs, and they get them out on people's boats, and they introduce them to boating, and they get them out on the water so that they can see the, the fun and the excitement of, of being on a boat and being in the water and we work with these associations where we can to um, help them get these people out into the water. Uh, the other area that we work with is with the youth groups. Uh, we spend uh, quite a bit of time working with, with youth and trying to introduce youth into boating as well. Uh, a couple of examples of that are that we work with a group in uh, New York City actually uh, called Rocking the Boat and we also work with uh, Shake a Leg Foundation in Miami and both those organizations are all about getting uh, young people introduced into boating and we do what we can there as well. Uh, with regards to pricing, uh, I said earlier that it's a misconception that uh, boating is, is expensive. Um, it, it doesn't have to be and it isn't. Uh, but, but we have a responsibility and other companies in the, the boating uh, market feel the same way uh, to help make sure that it doesn't get too expensive for people. And uh, we spend a lot of time and a lot of hard work on making sure that we have a full range of products that work very well, uh, they perform well, uh, but that we have choices across everyone's budget available to them. The third area of environmental regulations um, is a challenge for all of us. We work very closely with the federal EPA and the state level EPAs. Uh, we work very closely with industry associations to make sure that we're not just meeting today's minimum requirements, but we're looking out to the future and we're working towards the future. Um, it, our, our world is water. We, we spend all kinds of time on the water. We, we're in boating and, 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 and we, we and, and everyone in our industry needs to accept the responsibility that we need to protect those waters. Uh, sustainability is, is a very key focus for Axel Nobel as a company. Uh, we have some strong initiatives and programs in place to lower our VOC emissions of our products, to lower the, uh, the amount of biocides that we use in our anti-fouling paints, and also to significantly reduce the amount of waste that our facilities are generating going forward. Which type of boaters would these paints, Interlux and Allgrip, be good for? 
That's a good question. Um, we, we manufacture a full range of, of products um, for, 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 for anything really from a canoe up to a several hundred foot super yacht. Um, and we also manufacture paints for the do-it-yourself market, for the people that want to paint their own boat, oh. um, as well as a full range of products for the professional applicators uh, that you would take your boat to and have it professionally painted. Well, let's find out more about how Interlux and All Grip are impacting the industry in this 21st Century Business Field Report. For boat owners, the decision-making process around what kind of yacht paint to choose goes far deeper than just color. Matthew Krashowitz of the Whiskey Hotel shared with us the challenges his customers face when making this important decision. Hi, Captain Matthew here aboard Whiskey Hotel, an 80-foot trawler about to do a circumnavigation around the world. As you see behind us, we're just finishing up a one-month yard period and getting the boat ready for our adventure. We've decided to use Interlux bottom paint and all grip topside for its durability and long lasting. The bottom paint below us, we've had before for two years in the Southern Caribbean. No worries, no problems, and that's why we decided to use them again. The top side here is 10 years old and still shining. So we decided to use them again when we're repainting the stern. The challenge of finding the right paint solution isn't just on the boat owner, however. Boat yard owners carry even a greater burden as they must understand local regulations and requirements that may impact the decision. Joe Pertel of Axo Nobel, a major manufacturer of yacht paint, understands the challenges that both boat yards and boat owners must face when it comes to making an informed decision. Probably the most important thing to our customers is looking for a company that will stand behind all their products and take care of it whenever they have a problem. Uh, the other aspect is they like to know that uh, the finish they're going to use will come out perfect and that they're going to be very pleased with the end result. New technology is always coming to us uh, constantly, so we're constantly introducing new products. The technology, when most people would think it would be getting less and less, it's getting better all the time. We're finding new avenues and uh, new resources, so uh, we look to remain on top for the next 20 years as well. With a rich history dating as far back as 1881, Axo Nobel is not only dedicated to creating the most innovative, protective, and beautiful coating solutions available, they work tirelessly to ensure the entire process is smooth sailing. Of course, Fred Axo Nobel is a world-recognized industry name. How do the Interlux and All Grip brands fit within the overall company? Axel Nobel is the largest paint company in the world, and Interlux and All Grip are, are two of the brands under the portfolio of uh, several different companies and brands that Axel Nobel owns. One of the advantages of, of being part of Axel Nobel is that we are truly a global company, and uh, whether a boat, wherever a boat, uh, a boat owner may go, we're able to provide support and product to them, whatever port they may pull into anywhere worldwide. Mm -hmm. The other advantage of being part of Axel Nobel is that it really does give us a big pool of products and technologies and businesses that we can look at um, to see if there's any new ideas or innovations that we could pull from AXO to bring to the, the boating industry. So Fred, overall, what value do Interlux and All Grip bring to your customers? It's all about quality, really. Uh, it's the quality of the products, the quality of the people that we have working for us and supporting our customers out in the field. Um, that, that's what we deliver as uh, Interlux and All Grip. Customers that have been dealing with us for years uh, know that they can trust our brands. Mm. And I know these are really pretty well-known brand names in the boating industry. So what differentiates Interlux and All Grip from your competitors' products? The primary differentiation is, is service and support that we give to our customers. We, we have a, a large uh, sales team that covers North America. Uh, we have a 1-800 tech line uh, that people can call into, boat owners can call into, tradespeople can call into. We'll give them advice on how they can paint their boats, what products they should be choosing. Uh, we have a very interactive website that people can go to at yapaint.com, and we have a lot of literature out there, much more than mo most other companies have. So that really is the, the main differentiation between us and our competitors is the support and service that we give to our customers. Hmm. What does the future hold, do you think, Fred, for the recreational marine industry and, and for your company in particular? We, uh, we look forward to being able to continue to take advantage of the, of the growth that's going to come in the, in the coming five to ten years, as I discussed. Um, we have some great product solutions within Interlux and All Grip. We have some fantastic people working and supporting us, and uh, we continue to look forward to, to the growth. Well, thank you so much, Fred, for coming on the show today and for sharing Axo Nobel solutions with us. Thank you, Jackie. 
for 21st Century Business. I'm Jackie Bales. Thanks for watching.